we've got bugs, rain, and most importantly, Friday night football as Bennett Academy travels into the city to take on St. Rita. Both teams enter week four with a one and two record. We start this game off in the second quarter as St. Rita's Tommy Ulitowski finds B.J. Hall for the 25-yard gain. Same drive, St. Rita makes their way into the red zone, and on third down, Ulitowski looks for Calvin Lee in the end zone, but it's dropped. The Mustangs would miss the field goal and turn the ball over on downs. Last minute of the first half, Ulitowski throws to E.J. Nuwagwu, who makes some nice cuts to push them up the field for a big gain. St. Rita turns the drive into points. Ulitowski throws a 50-yard bomb into the arms of Nuwagwu, giving them a 7-0 lead going into half. Early in the third quarter, Ulitowski once again finds Nuwagwu on the sidelines for a solid game. The very next play, Kyle Clayton takes the handoff right up the gut for a 25-yard TD. 14-0 Mustangs. Bennett would give the ball right back to St. Rita, and that leads to Ulitowski with a pretty pass to B.J. Hall for the 30-yard grab. They once again turn a big play into points. Ulitowski hands it off to Clayton, who pushes and fights his way into the end zone for the touchdown. Now 21-0. Last play of the third quarter, Red Hawk Anthony Picciolini takes a big hit looking for Ryan Snell and the ball is fought for, but then it's picked off by Johnny Schmidt. In the fourth, following the interception, Bennett's Joseph Kiyu answers back with a diving pick to get the ball back. What an effort by the senior. Red Hawks looking to take advantage. Picciolini finds Michael Lawler who plows through a defender, getting it near the 10. Bennett trying to get on the board, but the St. Rita defense stands tall and keeps the offense out of the end zone to help the Mustangs complete the shutout. 21-0 the final. Oh man, I felt wonderful, but uh, I know my line felt more wonderful, so uh, I'm just thankful to have them on my team. So. Man, just overall, I'm just thankful just to go to war with them boys. Man, I'm just thankful. No, not at all. We just know that uh, it was just going to be a dog fight. So uh, just coming out on top, it's just like a great team win. So I'm just excited. Mentally, I think that, I mean, I think it pushed us back a little bit. But we came out, we stopped them a couple times. And I think we came out with the right energy, but we just couldn't match them on offense. 